basi tunaendelea na uchambuzi wetu wa tamthilia hii ya three sweet as one husband hii ni sehemu ya kwanza kabisa ya uchambuzi wa tamthilia hii tunasema act 1 sehemu ya kwanza kabisa sura ya kwanza tunaonaambia anasubiriwa kufika nyumbani kwa kina Juliet ili kuweza kumlipia mali Juliet tunaita to pay bribe price okay eh, tunaona kabisa inasema the scene scene breaks by Atangana who is complaining about his wife who has delayed to come back from the farm and cook for him Atangana analalamika kuhusu mke wake analalamika kwamba mke wake amechelewa kurudi kutoka shamba hadi sasa hivi hajapika kwa hiyo Atangana analalamika they have serious discussion in which Abesolo suggests that Atangana and Ondua should beat their wives and daughters Abesolo anawashauri Atangana na kaka yake Ondua kwamba Abesolo ni baba yao anawashauri kwamba mwe mnawapiga wake zenu na watoto zenu wanapokuwa wanafanya makosa kama hayo wapigeni msiwache ah pia inaendelea kusema kwamba on the same day they are expecting beer the civil servant to come in order to marry Juliet who is still studying at Libamba siku hiyo walikuwa katika mkakati wa kumsubiria sasa huyu mtu anaitwa mbia ambaye ni mfanyakazi huko serikalini wanategemea aje hapo nyumbani kwao kwa ajili ya kumlipia mahali Juliet to pay bribe price kwa ajili ya kumooa Juliet ah lakini wakati huo huo tunaendelea kuona kwamba unknowingly Juliet arrives the same day and when she is told the the idea of mailing beer she rejects it because she claims not to be uh, to love him ah Juliet anapofika na yeye bila taarifa yote anafika anatoka shule anafika nyumbani ni kipindi cha likizo hiki anapofika nyumbani anapewa taarifa ya kuolewa na mbia anakataa anasema siwezi kuolewa na mtu huyo simjui sina mpango naye ah tunaona kabisa the whole family is surprised to hear such a response and becomes disappointed by her action familia yote inashangazwa kwa mtoto yeye anaongea kitu gani jinsi gani amekataa kuolewa ah uh, tunaona kwamba the whole family expects to get rich through her tunaona familia imejipanga kupata pesa kupitia yeye kwamba atakapolipiwa mahali ile bribe price familia itapata pesa nyingi kutoka kwa yule atakayemwoa mtoto wao kwa wanategemea kwamba mtoto wao kiolewa watapata pesa nyingi ah uh, inaendelea kusema kwamba we are also told that pia we are also told that there is a young man young farmer called Ndi Ndi who has already paid 100,000 francs for Juliet ah tunamwona Ndi ni mtu ambaye alishalipia pesa siku za nyuma hapo kwa ajili ya kutaka kumooa Juliet kwa alishalipia bribe price ya flanka laki moja laki moja hiyo kumlipia kutaka kumooa Juliet. Huyu ni mkulima, kijana mkulima ambaye anaitwa Ndi. Eventually the civil servant arrives and everybody is impressed. Tunaona lakini pia bado ukiachana na Ndi kwamba ameshamlipia Juliet mahali hiyo bribe price ya kwa ajili ya kutaka kumooa lakini kumbuka yule mfanyakazi wa serikali ambaye ni uh, tunamuona pale mwanzo ambaye anaitwa Mbia mwenye mkakati wa kumoa Juliet naye anakuwa amefika nyumbani kwa kina Juliet kwa ajili ya kumtolea pesa. Kumbuka, hii ni sehemu ya kwanza. Mbia amefika nyumbani kwa kina Juliet kwa ajili ya kumtolea mahali Juliet na kumbuka pia ndiye amekwisha kulipia franka laki moja. Nini kitatokea kana mimi mpaka mwisho wa uchambuzi wa uh, tamthilia hii?